Hey folks, welcome. I know this is not the basketball court, and I'm used to you know doing recordings on the playground or maybe in my house, but this is definitely going to be a good one. I have a really cool actual um, sporting good that I just found, and I'll give you a look at it. This guy right here, see this nice cool blue guy? It's called a kickbow. A kickbow is spelled K-I-K-B-O. So this is a really cool actual, um, it's like a hacky sack. It's also considered to be called, a, what is it, a, a shuttlecock. Because like a shuttlecock, a shuttlecock has almost the same kind of feathery type of a thing but it's more like plastic and round so this is somewhat like a hacky sack and a shuttlecock combined so I'm gonna try it out this is my first time actually putting it on a video so hopefully y'all guys like what you see and hopefully I don't make too many errors and mistakes all right As you can see, it's not really that easy. You gotta get used to it. But um, it takes a lot longer for it to come down in the air than a hacky sack. So I highly recommend for people to check these out. I did a video review on YouTube on my channel for this actual product. And uh, check out the Kirkbow.com website if y'all guys wanna go and get any of these. They're actually going for a nice price there. Uh, I, I believe it's like $9.99 right now. They may drop the price down. So this is a really cool product. I'm going to keep trying, see if I can master it. And I'll do some tutorials once I learn how to get it down pack. And I'm really into Hacky Sack. And I'm going to do a comparison video soon as well. All right? Check out. Check it out.
as you can see, this is very fun. I tried a jester. I did two different jesters. One on one side, one on the other side. Hopefully y'all guys try this out. Like I said, kickboat.com is the location to find it. I'll put an annotation, a few annotations in this video. Some information on the description of the video so y'all guys can learn about it. And this is awesome, all right? This has like some rubber, multiple layers of rubber. Sorry about the noise in the background. Got a FedEx truck running around. <coughs> so, so it has multiple layers of rubber. One, two, three, four, five, six, about six layers of rubber and one plastic kind of thing. And they all layered like this. And then it has a core, which there's four feathers put in at 90 degree angles into the center of the core. And then at the bottom it has the nice logo that they have for, for Kickpo. Check it out. And that's about it. So if y'all guys want to definitely go, you know, try it out, make up your Kickpo videos, throw them up on YouTube, spread the love, tell as many people as possible about this video, this video, their videos. They have a video channel. I'll put that in the description and in the annotation so people can find their video channel as well. All right, let me do some more. Hey, how are That was another cool session right there. It works really good when you have many players. And I'm gonna invite my young cousins to try. Come on, guys.
right guys, we're gonna run out of power on this video, so I just wanted to give y'all a little bit of a display of multiple people doing it at once. It's a really good team game. You can do as many people as you want. Actually, the more the better. Do it in a big crowd, and you can shoot this thing really super high in the sky and do crazy tricks, like all this crazy stuff like that. Shots like that. I saw a lot of dudes doing it on YouTube, so I'm gonna try my best to get get up to that level and catch up and learn even more of the Kirkbow tutorials that they have to offer. And that's all I got. Hit the thumbs up if you like the video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and thanks for watching. Oh, and drop some comments. Thanks a lot. Peace.